Analisa anadai kwamba yeye na Ben Paul ni kifo tu ndicho ambacho kitawatenganisha. Sasa ameandika haya kupitia account yake ya Instagram. And by the way unafahamu anaandika haya kwenye kipindi ambapo watu wengi walishaanza kuamini kwamba pengine ndoa yake imepata shida au sio kutokana na kile ambacho wao wenyewe walikuwa na kiposi kwenye mitandao na vitu vingine kama hivyo. Lakini utakumbuka kwamba siku za hivi karibuni wao wenyewe wamejaribu ku clear hata eh, Analisa mwenyewe kwenye posti zake akiashiria tu kwamba mambo bado yako sawa na ndoa yao ipo kama kawaida. Sasa ameweka post kadhaa. Post ya kwanza ameweka kama unavyomtazama hapo akiwa kama anaji snap hivi alafu akaandika every time is a dead night over here life is too short akaongeza post ya pili hii ameandika with my best friend at Mona Lisa function one thing thought you can be sure about is that only death will separate us Hashtag upuzi hamna tena so hapa anachokimaanisha ni kwamba kwanza anasema yuko na rafiki yake eh Ben Po kwenye shughuli ya Mona Lisa na anasema kwamba kitu pekee ambacho anaweza kuhakikisha ama akawahakikishia ni kwamba kifo pekee ndicho ambacho kitawatenganisha yeye na Ben Paul. Alafu akaendelea, "Have you checked his new video walimwengu? I am the video model there. Let me tell you how the shooting came out." So anauliza tu kama eh, umeshaitazama video ya Ben Paul ya walimwengu na yeye ameonekana kama uh, model kwenye hiyo video. So hapa anaelezea uh, story ya hii video ambavyo ilitokea. Kwenye posti ya pili ameandika, "So I was like Let's go do a photo shoot by beach since it's long time since we did a shot together. So anasema kwamba aliamua tu kwamba waende beach waka pige picha kwa sababu imekuwa ni muda mrefu sana hawajapiga picha za pamoja. I organized a photographer BM Visuals and told him to also come with a video too so we could take shots for executive and life was still water by the beach. Eh kwa maana kwamba ali organize kwa maana kumtafuta huyo mpiga picha lakini akamwambia pia aje na e, mtu wa video au sio so walipanga ku shoot e, baadhi ya shots e, za maji kutoka kwenye kampuni yake kuna executive na still water imagine as he was taking the pictures he also took videos of our moments so anasema e, utashangaa ambapo jamaa alikuwa akipiga picha akachukua na video vile vile za matukio yetu hapo beach after a few days he sent us the video and ben was like In fact, sihitaji video nyingine ya walimwengu. This is the perfect visualizer. That's how he came out. Such an unplanned video. Go view the video on his YouTube. So anasema baada ya uh, siku chache huyu jamaa akawatumia video na Ben Paul akasema no, hii ni video nzuri sana. Sihitaji tena video kwa uh, sihitaji tena kushoot video kwa ajili ya wimbo wangu wa walimwengu. So anasema kwamba uh, baada ya Ben kuikubali ndo hiyo ikapandishwa kwenye YouTube channel na sasa hivi ukienda kwenye account ya Ben Paul utakutana na hiyo uh, video ya walimwengu ambapo imekuja tu na haikupangwa kabisa kama uh, Nelisa ambavyo anaeleza hapa. So you can see uh, kwamba sasa hivi ni mapenzi na mahaba matupu ambayo yanaendelea kati ya Nelisa na Ben Paul. Achana na hizo drama ambazo zilikuwa zinaendelea huko mitandao ni Nelisa anazita ni upuuzi tu au sio. Lakini ameongeza vile vile video hizi ambazo eh, ni siku walipokuwa wanafunga ndoa. Kama unakumbuka tulishawahi kukuwekea picha hapa picha ambazo zilianza kusambaa mitandao ni kwa sababu unaelewa ndoa yao ilikuwa ndoa ya siri sana. Hawakuweka wazi, walifunga ndoa na baada ya hapo ndo picha zikaanza kusambaa. So leo ameweka hizi video alafu kuna hii moja ameandika yep during our wedding day kwa maana ya kwamba e, wakati wa siku ya ndoa yao. Uh, kama unavyoona hapo yeye na Ben Paul wamejiachia na vitu vingine kama hivyo. Kuna hii nyingine akaweka ameandika wife duties e, kwa maana ya kwamba majukumu ya, ya, ya mwanamke ama ya mke hapa akiwa anamrekebisha Ben Paul kumweka vizuri na vitu vingine plus video zingine nyingi sana ambazo e, unazitazama hapo. So Analisa ameamua kuweka wazi kwamba watu wafahamu mbali na hizi drama ambazo zimekuwa zikiendelea huko kwenye mitandao ya kijamii. Yeye na Ben Paul kitu pekee ambacho kinaweza kuja kuwatenganisha ni kifo na sio masuala ya kuachana au sio? Hawachani. Anyway, una mtazamo gani? Niambie kwenye sehemu ya comments alafu subscribe kwa taarifa nyingi na badimpe kila wakati.